Hello, everyone. So in this video, I am going to. Hello, everyone. So in this video, I am going to explain that how to work as an industrial pharmacist in Australia. Okay, how to migrate to Australia as an industrial pharmacist. So uh, what is basically the process and uh, which documents are required? How much experience is uh, needed? Okay, and uh, what are the other documents? So if you want to migrate as an industrial pharmacist to Australia, so you will upload some documents like uh, your experience letter and uh, your educational documents to Vitasis. Okay, Vitasis is basically a body uh, which basically verify your documents. Okay, so you will upload your qualification and documents and uh, basically your uh, experience letter plus PTE exam certificate, right? Uh, you will only need English language exam, PTE exam, right? And there is no need of CAPS exam, okay, uh, to work as an industrial pharmacist uh, in Australia, right? And uh, your pay slips are needed basically for this purpose, okay? Pay slips, clear? So let me explain the whole process. So first you will write Vitasis in the Google, okay? Uh, professional occupations, you will click on professional occupations to check the basically the requirements, right? So in the search, you will write industrial pharmacist. So So it's loading. Okay, so basically, this is basically uh, industrial pharmacist, okay? So you will click on the industrial uh, pharmacist info sheet, okay? So the whole details, the requirements are present in this uh, PDF file, okay? So you will check, you will fulfill those requirements and you will apply to Vitasis. After receiving, after receiving this uh, assessment letter from the uh, Vitasis, uh, you will also apply to PT exam, okay? Uh, but uh, it will be better if you before uh, the receiving the assessment letter, you can apply to PT exam, clear? So, so uh, let's. Uh, Click on this uh, info sheet of industrial pharmacist. Okay. That what are the requirements? So you will fulfill those requirements. Okay. And you will upload your documents to Vitasis. So your passport is basically needed and your experience, your pay slips, your educational documents, your PTE uh, exam is basically uh, needed for visa, okay? So, job description. So, industrial pharmacists undertake research, testing and analysis related to the development, production, storage, quality control, and distribution of drugs and related supplies. So, this is basically the job description of industrial pharmacists in Australia, okay? Occupations not considered under, under this code is chemist, pharmacologist, clinical pharmacologist, okay? So if you have experience in industrial pharmacy, so uh, this is basically needed, right? Pharmaceutical industry uh, experience is required. So let's check the requirements. Criteria for positive skill assessment, comparable bachelor degree is needed, okay, uh, your uh, PhD degree, okay, and one year 
employment duration is required. One year experience is required. Okay. But I will suggest that you have at least uh, two or three years experience so uh, you can then apply. Okay. And what are the additional that high relevant paid employment uh, duration 20 hours or more per week? This is basically the mandatory requirement. Okay. And uh, the pay slips are very important. Okay. Pay slips. So you will uh, basically make an experience letter from uh, uh, that pharmaceutical industry in which you are working. Okay. Uh, at least two or three years experience is basically required and your uh, uh, bachelor degree, palm D degree. Okay. So these are some of the basic documents which you need. Okay. So then you will uh, create an account on the Vetasis website, which is very easy. Okay. But I will suggest you can hire a consultant. You can talk to consultant that this is basically Vitas's body and uh, you can upload my documents and uh, please process my case. Okay. So if you have any question uh, related to this process, so you can ask in the comment section and I will try to answer you. Okay. So, but the process is very easy. You can fulfill the documents, your bachelor degree. Okay. Your transcript, your educational documents, your passport, your birth certificate. Okay. Uh, so these are some of the documents, your experience letter and uh, your pay slips and PTE. So these all documents are basically uh, needed for the uh, VETASIS. PTE exam is basically a report is needed for the visa, but the rest of the documents are basically needed for VETASIS. Okay, so thank you so much. And uh, if you have any question, you can ask in the comment section. Thank you.